What's up guys? John here with Big Drew. And uh, we're always on the go, as you can see. We're getting ready to go somewhere right now. Always. Uh, always. Always busy, always doing something, right? So at that point, we get the question a lot. Hey, John, if we're on the go or we don't have any food by us right now, we need to eat. What could be a good alternative to fast food out there? Because there's a lot of fast food options. You can go into gas stations, you can processed food. You go to a fast food place like McDonald's, whatever it may be. And you're getting garbage food and you're putting your body. So I have my trick. I'm going to tell you mine and then Drew can tell you his. All right. My trick is, is use technology and use what we have going on right now. So you have Uber Eats, you have Grubhub, you have all these other things like DoorDash out there, even Instacart. So these places will deliver food to you. Now you're gonna say, well, McDonald's is on there and all these fast food places, so it's the exact same thing, right? Well, no, because you can pick other places like restaurants and stuff like that. I'll give you a, a good example. I order from Cheesecake Factory every day. No, I'm not eating cheesecakes from there. But what I do order is, is from the kitty menu. You're saying, well, why, John? Why are you order from the kitty menu? Because they have the most plain and bland stuff. And at that point, that's kind of what you want to put in your body. So I get grilled chicken breasts from there with right homemade mashed potatoes. I've got myself a meal and a good meal too at that. But one of my tricks is because I'm always just like John, always in a rush, always got to get to the gym. And I need fuel when I work out. So I never want to work out fasted. Um, I try to get a meal in and wait an hour and eat. If I can't get to like what he said, a restaurant, this and that, I'm going to give you guys a trick for grocery stores. Every town has a grocery store. A lot of places don't have fast food places. And a lot of like these small towns you go to if you're traveling, they may not even have a, a Walmart or something like that. So right. grocery store, if you guys need a quick workout, a quick mm -hmm. something small, mm -hmm. a banana is always good. Mm -hmm. Natural peanut butter is always good. Mm -hmm. Honey's always good. You could put all three of those together. Mm -hmm. If you want to add some protein, carton egg whites, not in the shell, carton egg whites are safe to drink straight out of the carton, mm -hmm. or you can mix those as well. So if you go in the grocery store and you grab a carton of egg whites, chug the carton of egg whites, eat your banana, a scoop of peanut butter and some honey. If you want to add to that, maybe a little bit of ground cinnamon to thin out your blood a little bit. And obviously the ECA Hercules is going to give you a pump too. Oh yeah. But that's just basically what I do. If I'm traveling, if I'm in a hotel, I like to have oatmeal because all hotels have a microwave. Mm -hmm. And again, the liquid egg whites, they don't have to be cooked. So you can mix those right in with your oats and eat them as well. Mm -hmm. Make sure you get your fuel in before you work out mm -hmm. and make sure you have enough time after you eat so it's not going to affect your workout so it's properly absorbed. Just my trick to go, make sure you eat and make sure you train after you eat. Don't just eat them, just yeah. stay. And guys, it's not the old model, calories in, calories out. Not all our calories are created equal, right? If I eat a piece of cheesecake and I eat a steak, it's going to be totally different calories going in as far as macros and stuff like that. So make sure you're getting good food sources. It's not just about the calories either. It's also about the micros too. Don't just look at macros, macros. People yep. look at carbs, calories, and protein. But those micro ingredients are very important too. Yep. Look at your micros, not just your macros. Yep. And keep your sodium low and your sugar low and your lactose to almost nothing. So guys, this is just some tips and tricks for me and Drew to make you guys more healthier, perform better, and live tight and strong every day.